What's up everyone, my name is Nigark. Welcome back to RimWorld. I hate to do this, but I feel like I have to restart. I tried playing, I tried recording the other game, and I very quickly lost, um, Singer, and it just wasn't a good spot. So I'm gonna start on Cassandra Classic again, and I'm gonna sort of, like, edit together who I pick for my people. Um, I'm, I will show off where I select here, though. I'm probably gonna try a different area, just to, just to try something different. So let's go with... It'll be close to what I had last time. Growing period is year round. That actually sounds pretty good. So we're gonna select this site, and then I'm gonna I'm gonna do this and let you know who I pick. Okay, so I think I have my people picked out here. So we got a 44 year old that will be our shooter and melee person. They are also a prostophobe, so they don't like prosthetics. Steadfast, so they won't get uh, mentally broken down so easily, and bloodless, they they don't mind fighting at all. And they're incapable of crafting and cleaning, I think that's fine. This person is incapable of nothing, so that they can do everything. And they're gonna be really good at research. Some, I think research is something that I didn't even try last time. And I, I think I need to get into that a little bit faster. They're a bit abrasive, so they aren't very good socially, but I mean they have a decent social skill. Um, night Owl, so they like to work at night, and they're always in sort of a bad mood, so that's Shakla. And then we have Browse, who's going to be our Miner and Grower. They're incapable of intellectual, I don't actually know what that means. Like, it might just mean that they can't do research, and I think that's fine. And then their mental break threshold is low, and they're a little bit lazy. So I think that's okay, these are going to be our three starting people, and then I'm going to stop recording here, we're going to load up the place, and I'll see you on the other side. Okay, here we are, we're going to start it up again, we're immediately going to pause it. Um, tell them that they can start grabbing these things if they would like. Actually, wait to pause. So, Shakla, it was Hay House, right? That was our shooter? Yeah, Hay House, you're gonna get the survival rifle. Make sure all of these things are untouched. Uh, let's see. You're not very good at shooting. You're definitely not good at shooting. So, I'm pretty weak combat-wise, but I think that will be fine. We're going to turn off the auto zoning here. And we are going to tell them, hey, it's time to cut some wood. So this area, chop all of this wood. We're going to need a lot of wood to get things started, right? And then also, we're going to want a little bit of steel. Not too much steel to start out, but a little bit of steel is going to be nice. And we need to start zoning the areas. So while they're working on that, I am going to do a stockpile here. Let's do a smaller stockpile for right now. Let's do like a 6x6 six six right there, and also a 6x6 six six right here. That'll leave us room to expand, but not give them too much to do right now. And then we want to work on a place for them to sleep. So a place for them to sleep. Oh, I don't want to dig into this. This looks scary. A place for them to sleep will be like right here. Nine. Yeah, that, this will be their sleeping area for right now. Furniture. Uh, we want wooden beds. QQ. Just, just four for right now. And then we're also going to want to build... Uh, am I going to have any steel? I am going to have some steel. I think I would like to... Eh, no, we'll do a regular thing for right now. Just a regular power place. And that'll be sort of off to this side. So it needs to be batteries are that big, and then there's a door. Because I really liked my power place last time. I really, really did. So a door there, a door there. What are you doing? Cutting poplar tree, okay. And yeah, if you guys want to, you guys can actually chop up the wood in here. That would be, that would be super. So they did get a little bit of steel for me, so I can do some things out of steel. And let's see what else I can do here. Uh, we will set this up to be the food storage one right now. Allow rotten... Actually, don't allow rotten on this one. We're gonna do... All foods as well as some body parts. And priority on that will be preferred. 
Yeah, they're sleeping in the rain. Uh, it's terrible. You are like really out in it. Slept in the cold, on the ground, outside. Ate off the ground. Like you're you're in a bad spot already. You already hate me. I'm gonna do a wooden table in here with a couple of a couple of chairs in here. Pretty much the same start as last time, but I feel like I know what I'm doing a little bit better. Just a wee bit better. Just like a smidge. And I think I am going to immediately get... It was the top one that was the food one. Okay, that's where it is. I was like, I can barely see the outline here. Do it like this. And then you have to be able to click on this one because I can barely see it. Just like this. This is plenty of room for them to sort of squeeze by and be able to get inside and stuff. And then we're also going to need to start working on some power. So I'm just going to have the power like off to the side of this and last time I needed more than just two to supply everything that I needed. So we're going to work on that. And then we can come in here and we can say everyone's going to prioritize firefighting. I still think that's a good thing. You are going to be our priority doctor with these guys secondary, if they have to. If, you, if you're if you hurt, you're going to prioritize getting fixed. You can prioritize flicking switches, that's totally good. Warden, I don't really have any use for. Handling, eh. You are going to prioritize growing because you have a passion for it. Even though your skill is one right now, they have a burning passion for it. Like, that's something that they really want to do. You're going to be a two there. You're going to be a one on hunting. Was it Hay House that has... Yeah, he's our shooter, so he's really good at hunting. He's like super good at hunting. And also decent at growing, so we will start zoning for some growing. And I think my growing zones are going to be a little bit bigger. I think I was being too cautious last time. Sounds like a monkey. I swear I heard a monkey. I guess I didn't hear a monkey. I was almost certain that I heard it. Um, where do we want growing? I guess for right now, it can be over here. Let's do like 8 by 8s I think my growing before was too tiny. I'm not really sure if having spaces in between them is necessary, but this one will be corn. Top left will be potato, this one will be rice, and this one will be zerygium. Yeah, still not entirely built here. Hopefully they start fixing that, but they at least all have a bed this time. That's... that's something. Mining, um, you will be priority on mining. So if I have any mining tasks, they're gonna hop on it. You're gonna be secondary on growing. Um, priority on animals. Secondary, 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 and secondary. And then primary on research. Yeah, that looks pretty good. That looks pretty good. They've just... I, I built so many things. I This is a thing that I do constantly in games, is I just build everything at once. It's a really, really bad habit. I should stop doing that, because then it means that nothing actually gets done. Like, this house needs to be built. Also, I did change my temperatures to Fahrenheit, so I know 79 degrees, not that bad outside. It's actually pretty cozy outside. Like, for me, comfortable weather is, like, 70 degrees Fahrenheit. Which I looked, and I think is that, like... I don't, I don't remember. I did look it up, though, to see what that was in Celsius. Oh, right, I have to change the restrictions. You guys can do anything whenever. Unrestricted. Yes. Good. And also, I need to zone my home area. Because my home area is nowhere, actually. This is my home area. There are many just like it, but this one is mine. Yeah. Pretty, pretty sweet. Uh, this is going to be Nagar Nagarkatan... The second, because I failed on the first, and I don't honestly have a better name for it. I really do not. 
I'm gonna wait to place the batteries until this is all set up, even though I would- Eh, you know what, I don't have to. Because they wouldn't have power in them anyways. What are you building? Oh, I think they're removing a tree that's in the way. Oh, that is a monkey! Start- Oh, wait, that's my monkey? <gasps> Starlight is my monkey! Oh, you're getting so obedienced. Um, does it say what type of food they like? Health, training, I don't... Trainable intelligence advanced, huh? I don't... I don't know what kind of food monkeys would like. I don't think I can place bananas, can I? Hold on. Uh, squirrel self-tamed. A squirrel has become tame and is now designated Squirrel 1. Nailed it. I nailed it. I already have a squirrel. Is banana a recipe here? Bananas are not a recipe. I feel like that. We need bananas. What are these? Boom rats? Yeah, boom rats. I've heard rumors of those things. Awfully cute when they aren't deadly. Uh, three, four batteries. And I'm also going to tell them, you know, we may need to mine a little bit more stuff here. I'm trying to be, like, super mindful of this, because I think this can have really bad stuff in it. And I obviously do not want uh, really bad stuff happening to me. Also, everyone is going to have secondary on hauling. I don't have anyone that can be a dedicated uh, hauler right now, but... Oh, yeah, Jerbear Spy. I don't have anyone that can be a dedicated hauler, but, I mean, secondary hauling is pretty good. Get rid of that. And it's telling me I need some defenses. So, once I get my power up, I will start working on a few turrets here and there, especially because raiders are jerks. Last time, raiders just kicked my ass. What is that? Hold on, I need to pause. Alright, my apologies. You may hear a weed whacker. Someone decided to weed whack their yard at 4... 4.20 in the afternoon, on the dot, and in, like, 40 degree weather. Who... who... who to dunk it? Wow. I don't know why you would do that, but... Sure. Go weed whack your yard, by all means. Jeez, what weird timing. People are weird. Uh, you're still getting me a bunch of steel over here. Both of them are. Just surprising because... Oh yeah, I guess secondary if your construction is low. You know what, we're gonna make your construction one, because you do have a passion for it. Mad animal. Oh shoot, I didn't jump to location. Which one is mad? Shoot, I didn't jump to the location. I don't know which one is mad. It's probably gonna charge my establishment. My colony, so I have to look for it. Colonist needs treatment. What? It's the mad animal! Hunt it! The squirrel! Man, you got- you got scratch in the torso, scratch in the torso, and a bite. Jesus. But it's dead. <laughs> so, that's- thank goodness for tiny favors. I'm gonna speed things back up. I really need to chop this wood, though. A pop idol named Min Young Min Kim calls from you from nearby. She is being chased by tribes people, and she begs for safety. 29 years old. Yeah, we're gonna offer her safety. Um, she is really good at social and artistic. We're gonna draft you, tell you to come over here. We're probably gonna have to draft all of my people. Where is my base? Oh, Squirrel 1 is over there, nice. Uh, Browse is not my shooter, it's Hay House that's the shooter. Once he's done there... Yeah, we're gonna- we're gonna send him on a hunt. We're gonna undo that. Where'd you go? There's the raid. Jump to location, it's this one dude up here. Does she have any gear? She doesn't have any gear. So we're actually gonna try to get her safe. Well, Hay House, you're coming out here, bud. Hey house, you're coming out here, bud. We're gonna take cover behind a tree. You're gonna continue running. We'll undraft you, actually. Nope! Never mind, you're getting drafted again. You're stupid. You're going out there.
Fire at him. Nice. Keep shooting him. Keep shooting him. Did he get hit at all? Oh, nice. Oh, he got annihilated. He is in extreme pain. Undraft. Strip him. And I don't have a way to capture him right now. Wow. Capture. Yeah, I don't I don't have a place um for captured nerds. I will have one though. So you got treated up, right? Yeah, it looks like it looks like Browse is pretty pretty good. Now where did she go? She's still drafted. We're gonna undraft her. And then we can tell her, um You can do anything. You don't have to sleep here. And that person weed whacking is like done after two seconds. Like they didn't even didn't even entirely weed whack. Hello, cargo pods with some iguana skin. Okay, why not? Like who weed whacks for two minutes and then is done? So you are going to firefight a secondary doctor, one patient, two art, two tailor, two smith. And you cannot haul. Ugh. Why do you suck? Why do you suck so bad? Nice! This is finally built. We finally have that built. Wanderer joins. Oh, oh my goodness, we already have five people now? Landon. He has a wooden mace. Wow, he is really good with animals and he kind of wants to craft stuff. He has a lot of burning passions there. He cannot shoot or melee though. He is incapable of being violent. So one, two, one, two, two, two. We'll do two, one, 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 two, one, two. And I don't know if this is a good idea, but he he's gonna be like my dedicated hauler, I guess, for right now. I don't have anyone with the passion for hauling. I don't even know if you can. But I do need some things moved around, you know? Oh boy, I'm getting really interrupted this video. One second. I am so sorry. I, editing this is going to be a nightmare. Just everything keeps coming up uh, in the middle of me recording. So I'm super, super sorry about that. Okay, we finally have one power. So we can start running our power conduits through the walls. Just through all of the walls, just like this. Have some branch off like this. Through these walls, because it's kind of important a little bit. Straight through here. And deconstruct, or cancel this. Because I went one too far on that. Nice. We're finally getting somewhere. And also what I need, I'm going to slow this down just a little bit so I can start getting things... Um, start getting some more things placed down while I sort of explain why I'm doing things. So I'm going to get an area for capturing people. It doesn't have to be cozy by any means. It's just going to be like bare, bare minimum. Like wooden door, wooden door, um, furniture. It's just going to be a sleeping spot. Like it's not going to be cozy. And I may actually be able to get... That guy is back to doing his freaking... His yard. People are so weird. If I weasel this right, I can do this too. With a wooden door here. And a sleeping spot right... Like that. Yeah, that'll be cool. Oh my goodness, my storage is already full. Um, I wasn't anticipating that. Not in the slightest. So I may have to expand the structure of this a little bit. I don't know what these steam geysers are for, either. So if you want to tell me what that's all about, feel free, because I have not a, not a single clue. Like, not a clue in the world. We can expand it like this. Yeah, let's expand it like that. Uh, I guess I should have put a... 
No, I don't technically need a door for it because this one will feed into it. But I guess uh, for ease of access, we can do, do, do a door. Ease of access door. So they'll have two sides to be able to go. Landon. Why would you sleep there when we have a perfectly good bed over there? Also, I forgot to do this for him. And I think I forgot to build him his own bed. Technically, none of them are owned. The dude is back to doing his lawn. I don't understand. I don't actually understand. And then we're also going to get a, an actually a quite nice area for this. This is something that I died to last time. I'm going to get a steel structure for medical. A steel structure for medical. It's going to be like right here. It's going to be quite nice actually. Like quite nice. With a steel door. This one is going to get um, priority on sterile tiles because that is needed. Ooh, sterile tiles is actually really expensive because you need silver. Yeah, I need like 18... I need a bunch of silver for that, basically. So... What if I do, like, a split here with steel walls? Yeah, like a split there. I don't know if these have to be their own rooms. But just for, just for sake of argument, I will have it be its own room. And it's gonna be a bed in here, and that will have the sterile tiles. That will have sterile tiles there. And now we can also um, deconstruct this wall and zone this stockpile. It should copy all of its um, properties. All of the properties for this one should carry over into that. And now it is time to get, uh, what is it, production, a butcher table in here, as well as a cook stove in here. And once those are built, I have to remember to add the bills to that. I always forget to add the bills to that. You guys are allowed to take that scroll, you know. And I also need um, temperature, cooler, in there. We got some travelers passing by, that's fine. And also we need security. Just a couple little turrets here. In fact, I need to expand my power over to these new buildings. So we will do it like this. Again, I'm not sure about the redundancy needs for, for power. So for right now, I'm not going to do that. Landon, you're dumb. I just want you to know that. Like, why would you choose to be there? And then security. Um, once the conduits are built, I can start placing that down properly. Like, over here I can place. Poor mood, we need some food. We'll have one, like, here. One colonist idle. Okay, yeah, you shouldn't be idle at all. Actually, like, at all. But I think we will hunt a little bit. Orders. Hunting. I get that rabbit. I'm not fighting the boomalopes. Those things will mess up my day. They explode when they die. I'm just saying, I watched a video and they explode when they die. Boom rats maybe be able to handle that, I think. And I think we're gonna restrict my animals to, um, home. Uh, where are they? Restrictions? Animals. Home area. And I should also zone out my home area a little bit better. So like right here, up here, did we get it? Landon, you are so lazy. Ancient danger, as Min draws near the ancient well, a sense of foreboding overcomes her. She isn't sure why, but she feels that this dusty structure may contain great danger, which is this. That's what they're talking about, is that. Okay, so he's dead, so this, this area doesn't matter too much. And you can see this guy doesn't have cataracts. Freaking 
Oldie McOld last time had cataracts. Jeez. And then this will be our medical bed. Well, a medical bed, I should say. It's not going to be our entire thing. Solar flare. Our solar flare has begun. The intense radiation will shut down all electrical devices. It should pass in about a day. Okay. I think I think leaving off on the solar flare is going to be a good way of doing this. So we're going to overwrite that save right there. My name is Nick Gark. This is Rimworld, and thank you for watching.